Hi, my name is Anjan, I'm Managing Director, and for Rocket Reach, I give it a 4 out of 5. For more reviews like this, click below. So prior to using Rocket Reach, it was more of a manual process for us to actually scope out contacts and their details. So utilizing any number of platforms like LinkedIn, uh, online searches and sleuthing and so on and so forth. It was extremely uh, cumbersome uh, par prior to using Rocket Reach. I was actually very skeptical at first of using uh, Rocket Reach, but one of the reasons that I, we started using it was because it actually claimed to have this robust database of contact names and numbers. Um, I think they had said uh, upwards of over 400 million contact details. Um, that's what actually prompted us to use Rocket Reach, and we were so glad that we did because it really cut down on our timing um, and required to source out contacts, save those contacts, download them, uh, the contact details, so on and so forth. So, yeah, it definitely was the robust um, database that this uh, that this uh, application came with that led us to use it. It was extremely easy to start with Rocket Reach. The uh, the web page loads without any problems. Um, the search uh, definition parameters uh, can be identified right off the bat, um, and the results are instantaneous. Um, the uh, all of those three things combined, because of the ease of, of launching it, because of the ease of searching for the material, um, it was absolutely not a problem at all uh, getting started with Rocket Reach. Uh, the recommendation that I have for anyone contemplating using Rocket Reach is a couple of things. Number one, be aware of the search parameters. You probably don't want to use this application to just uh, do a willy-nilly search uh, of the database um, because it, you are limited to the number of searches you can do by by the membership plan that you that you have for yourself or the enterprise. It's not an unlimited search component, as far as I know. So to have that forethought in mind will actually make it more powerful. The second is after the launch, uh, the search has been concluded, and even if you're doing a bulk search, you actually have to have a method by which to collect the data and download the data. So what I would recommend is you actually have some sort of a, a database or somewhere to where you can actually download this information uh, from the application itself. Because as far as I know, the application doesn't allow you to directly communicate with the clients that you've searched out. So those two things, number one, have your search parameters identified right up front, and number two, have somewhere to actually collect the data thereafter. Those will be my recommendations.